Okay, I wanna go over one of my most favorite features about M3 hotel accounting software. We're going to run our trial balance. So we're right here in Accounting Core in M3. Trial balance. We're gonna pull from January through July so that your year-to-date column will populate. And then you click no to zero amounts so that there aren't a bunch of extra accounts with no data in them makes it a little more concise. Okay, so here is our trial balance and it starts with the balance sheet accounts. And then if we scroll through to the next page, we're gonna get to our rooms department. So we've got revenue, payroll, and then other expenses. The other expenses is what I wanna highlight right now because these are things coming in from your accounts payable module. And if you are researching um, trying to spot check your numbers, or figure out what needs to be reclassed or accrued at the end of the month. Um, you might be scrolling through your expenses. Let's just stop on one. So let's say guest supplies. If you click on this far right column, the 22,000, so that is gonna be your year to date number um, that was expensed to guest supplies. Okay, so when we click down on that number, it's gonna show us every invoice, everything that was coded to guest supplies for the entire year. So January, February, March, every month is gonna have totals. And then you can just go through here and research, hey, this thousand dollars looks a little high, what was that? So when you click down on that number, it's gonna show you how the invoice was coded. So this was um, fully coded to guest supplies. If it wasn't, it'd have a breakdown of all the different GL codes. We can tell that a check was written for it and that it's cleared the bank. Now right here, this is what I wanna show you. This It's a little picture of a scanner. And that means that an invoice was actually scanned in as backup. So you can actually see a picture of that invoice that was scanned in as backup. You can drill down and look at the detail of that invoice and say, oh, nope, that was coded to the wrong place. I need to reclass it or, oh yeah, now I remember. Okay, so that was in the trial balance, but you could do the exact same thing for the income statement. So here's the income statement. Um, let's say we wanna drill down on this 3,400, that's guest supplies again. Okay, so here's everything that was posted for the month. Let's say this 537 doesn't look quite right to us. Then the coding detail will pop up, the payment information will pop up. You can go a step further and click on the little scanner icon. Then the copy of the invoice will pop up. You can just do all your research right at the click of your fingertips. It's so convenient. This is what I tell people all of the time. Run your reports in M3. You have all the information. It's so easy to research. You don't have to um, get a PDF. And then when you have a question or a number looks odd, you have to email someone or call someone and ask like, hey, what was, what was coded here? What is this? If you're in M3, you can just click down every time you have a question. Hey, that number looks odd. Let me click down and see what was in it. Hey, I don't remember spending that money. Let me click down and see what was in it. Everything is there for you and it just makes um, managers, owners, operators, accountants, it makes our life so much easier because um, when we have a question, we can get an answer. It doesn't have to linger. We don't have to have back and forth with anybody. Um, it's awesome.